Hey, what is cooking today? Like, are we gonna be in the kitchen or we're gonna make tea or something? Muna, what do you have for us today? I can't wait to see this. Really? Why don't you wait and watch to the end of the video? <laughs> well, guys, hi family, you're welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, in today's video, I'll be taking you all and teaching you and showing you how to make a herbal world hair rinse that will stimulate your hair growth, reduce breakage. In fact, you don't want to miss this. So, if you are yet to subscribe to my channel, please press the subscribe button and watch to the end of the video. And if you are an OG, you're welcome back. So then, also like and share this video with your friends and family. Without further ado, without any talk and do, let's just go straight to the video. So let's start. So in today's video, I'll be using some herbs and the first on the list is our fennel. Fennel is actually the first on the list. Fennel stimulate growth, strengthen the hair and also fight dandruff. Fennel seeds are rich in vitamin C, magnesium and calcium. Why the next on the list is our cumin? Cumin helps to treat hair loss, gets rid of dandruff, and also gives your hair shine, gets rid of dandruff, and strengthens the hair strands. And cumin is also a very good herbs when you use it to cook your meal. And then the star of the show is our rosemary, rosemary herbs. Rosemary stimulates hair growth. Rosemary also aids in blood circulation to the scalp. Rosemary promotes hair growth. And it offers anti-inflammatory benefits that helps to nourish your hair follicles. It also has analgesic properties that soothe an inflammatory scalp. It also has shine and luster to the hair. And it unclogs hair follicles and also prevents dandruff. I must say rosemary is now my favorite herbs for now. The mint leaf. Mint leaf is rich in menthol. Mint helps in hair growth because it has the ability to stimulate increased blood flow to the scalp and hair roots, which provide healthy hair follicles and longer, fuller hair. What can beat that? Then the next is oregano. Oregano is one of the best leaves used for hair care and hair growth. It penetrates deep into the scalp and helps in making it clean from dirt, excess oil, improves thinning hair, and stimulates hair growth. It also improves hair quality, making them shinier, smoother, and strong. And all these herbs can actually be taken, you can actually ingest and drink them as your tea. Then the next on the list is our glass jar that I'll be using to store this uh, mixture. It's better to use a glass jar. Don't use um, rubber, please, to avoid the chemical reaction that actually occurs when you use um, plastic. Then the next, we are using our apple cider vinegar and they want to use the one with the mother. And it is brag that I'm using. I see that that is more authentic to me. So use any apple cider vinegar with mother. So apple cider vinegar is amazing. It helps to restore your scalp pH. It also helps to cleanse your scalp as well. And apple cider vinegar, you can also ingest it and use it to as um, tea rings. And so these are all the herbs we'll be using. But today we're not going to use all actually. I will be concentrating on rosemary. So you can infuse any of those and use them as your herbal rings. But today I will be making use of rosemary herbs. I'll be putting it in my glass jar. You can also use the fresh leaf. If you're using the fresh leaf, you have to take more. But if you're using the dried leaf, little goes a long way because you know that dried leaves, they are more potent. But I'll be mixing the rosemary with the mint. So you can actually mix two herbs. Two herbs is, you can mix two herbs. I add then the other ones, I mix them in another glass jar later on after the video so i have all of them mixed in a glass jar so i'll be adding since i we didn't have the mint leaf available but now we have it available right now so i'll be pouring the i'll open the tea bag then i'll pour the mint leaf right inside the glass jar together with the rosemary herbs 
try to mix both together so that's it like so I decided to add extra <laughs> there might be I I really didn't need to add extra really more I just wanted to add extra because this word is going to be used by my mother and I and sometimes my cousin can come and take some so even Funke can also come and take with Tawala so that's why I'm adding more actually so the next is my apple cider vinegar try and shake it please shake it thoroughly before use so I had to go back and shake it I didn't shake it before so I've sh shaked it already then I'll be pouring it. Please pour enough to cover the herbs. Pour enough to cover the herbs. So I had um, a smaller jar, it's another one remaining before. So I had to stop by, stop and go take that one. So I'm gonna add it now into this mixture. And now we are done. So you cover your mixture and then you can allow this thing to infuse for two days before putting it in the refrigerator. And this herbal infused, um, apple cider vinegar herbal infused mixture can actually last you for a longer time. You can even use it for your salad dressing. You can drink it as a, add it to your tea to drink and it will definitely reduce breakage for you and it can even help you reduce cholesterol especially when you use the fennel or the cumin so the next method is actually the boiling method and this one is for my sisters who are in a hurry who doesn't have maybe you didn't infuse anything you can use this method as well just put a water in the pot put it on put it on heat once it's boiled for like two minutes then you add your herbs you can add any herbs of your choice like i told you i'm using rosemary i'll add the rosemary then i'll cover it and allow it to boil for extra 20 minutes after that put it down allow it to cool and i will still go ahead i still always add two cupful of apple cider vinegar still into this and then use it directly to rinse my hair and my scalp and i don't wash rinse i don't i use it after my conditioning i use it at my final rinse and it has helped me greatly to reduce breakage you can try this sisters are you still waiting to subscribe have you subscribed yet if you're still watching and you are yet to subscribe to my channel please press the subscribe button like this video share this video with your friends and family and also tell me in the comment section have you tried the apple cider herbal hair rinse before what herbs do you think you would like to use? Are you team rosemary, team fennel, lavender, happy scots, or lavender, chamomile? What's your favorite herbs you would like to use to do your own infusion? Please let me know in the comment section. So guys, thank you so much for watching. See you all in the next video.